Hello, Zach here from PC Industries. We get a lot of calls every day, people want to know where to find their model and serial number on different engines. We've done some videos in the past and we want to show you today where to find your serial number for a 53 series inline engine. Where, you, where you're going to find that serial number is on the right hand side of the engine. And just as with every other Detroit diesel engine, two cycle, you designate the right and left hand side of the engine by standing at the rear of the flywheel housing. And the serial number is located on the back right hand top side of the block. The model number will be stamped first and then generally the serial number. And we'll zoom in and get a close up shot for this and it will explain to you what the numbers mean. All right, we're zoomed in here where you can see everything good. Uh, we're looking at the model number. That's the first four digits, or the first eight digits at the top of the block there. 5043-8301. The five tells us that it's a 53 series engine. The 53 series engine has both inline and V configurations, but all of the 53 series engines will start with a five. Unlike inline 71 series engines, which will start with a one, or V71 series engines which may start with a 7. The 53 series will only start with a 5. The next two digits, 04, tell us that it is a four cylinder engine. The fourth digit tells us, number three, tells us that it's an industrial application. The fifth digit being an 8 tells us that it's an RD configuration, a right hand rotation engine with everything mounted on the right hand side respectively. The 3 indicates that it's a turbocharged engine. And the 01 tells us what side the starter configuration is in reference to the flywheel housing. The bottom row of numbers and digits there, 4D-230133 is the engine serial number. And all of the inline and V set V53 engines will have either a 2D for 253, 3D for 353, 4D for 453 all of those which are inline, or a 6D or an 8D, which would be a 6V or an 8V53. Those serial number locations will actually be in a different place and we'll do a video later to show you what that location is. But those last six digits there will tell you how the engine was built up and that's important to give to your parts technician. But it's also important to remember that there is a chance that this engine may have been rebuilt over the years and that someone may have made a change. Sometimes those changes, if they make them and they don't change the serial number, it will cause us to be able to, to where we we'll, might ship you the wrong parts. So it's always good to give that engine serial number, to find a description of the engine of where your blower and your exhaust are mounted, maybe even take a couple pictures to send to the parts technician so that we can give you the correct parts the first time. We appreciate your time. Thank you.